Will Tanner was raised to be a rancher with a good eye for horses and a fast gun hand. You're just looking for trouble, boss. Shorty's right. He's got a mean streak in him. Too late. Already on him. Let him go, Shorty. <laughs> Is he dead? Uh-huh. Oh, my lord. What do you want me to do about that horse? Want me to pull the saddle off? No. You go find Cal and Slim and a couple of shovels. I'll take care of the horse. That damn horse is a man-killer. I'm afraid you're right. Holding the bridle, he forced the roan's head down so he could look him in the eye. Go back to hell where you came from. You killed a good man today. <laughs> But the death of surrogate father Jim Hightower puts him on the road to clear his head and find his fortune. Won't you be needed here at the ranch? No, ma'am. Not really. Shorty and the others can handle everything here. There aren't but a handful of cattle left to worry about, and the horses. They don't need me. Fate has a different future in mind for the young ranch hand. You be Luther Gamble, I reckon. Never mind who I am, you son of a bitch. I know who you are. And that's a piece of bad luck for you. It's eye for an eye. You might have brought my boy in to hang, but by God, you're gonna go with him. That don't make a lot of sense when you've got all these guns aiming right at you and your boys. What guns? There ain't nobody but you, and I'm tired of hearing you talk. Maybe you better listen to what he's telling you. What? <laughs> partner i was in a tight spot there and i doubt i could have got out of it without at least one of them putting a bullet in me are you one of the deputies from up kansas way no i ain't no deputy i just came in to get a drink and some supper you consider working for the u.s marshal service <laughs> shoot no why not i wouldn't have even mentioned it to you but i ain't ever seen a man with better makings for a deputy marshal than you do me and yourself a favor and think about it the Marshal Service needs men that think fast and ain't scared when bullets are flying. Helping an outgunned lawman sets Will on a new trail. If I hire you, you'll be working almost all the time in Indian Territory. And that's not a particularly healthy country for Deputy Marshals. Pride can tell you that if he hasn't already. How well do you know that country? Some. Well, I expect you'll get to know it better if you last long enough. I'll tell Judge Parker I've hired you, and he'll officially commission you as a U.S. Deputy Marshal. So I'll just say welcome to the service. I hope it suits you. And you suit the service. The job is a simple one. Catch lawbreakers by whatever means necessary, and bring them to Judge right, Parker's Gamble, court to be tried. tried In the wide and wild the Oklahoma degree. Indian Territory, his authority will be unlimited. Hanging. But equally limitless state, will be the dangers he faces. And may God have mercy on your soul. William W. Johnstone's Will Tanner, U.S. Deputy Marshal, Book One, now in graphic audio.